Hippocrates, Dr. Medicine. Legend speaks of Hippocrates, the father of medicine and champion of science. His namesake can be found in the Hippocratic Oath, a vow taken by healers even to this day. A descendant of Heraclean lineage, Hippocrates was born into wealth on the island of Kos. He was educated in the ways of healing by his father, a physician, and also worked with him as his apprentice. Indeed, Hippocrates rose to become a stellar practitioner of his chosen trade, healing many of the sick and wounded he came across, including the king of Macedonia. But it was an awful sickness that was to test his medicinal mettle, a contagion in the Greek capital. Following a Spartan invasion, Athens was sick with the plague. On investigation, Hippocrates noted that iron workers were unaffected and deduced the arid nature of the climate in which they worked shielded them against the plague. With this in mind, Hippocrates diagnosed the illness and made a simple yet macabre prescription for all Athenians. He instructed that all cadavers and clothing of the infected were to be scorched that drinking water was to be boiled, and each home was to house fire as to recreate the dry atmosphere of an ironworks. And not long after, all traces of the plague had vanished. Athens was cured thanks to Hippocrates and his eye for symptoms. From this deed and others, his renown would rise beyond Greece to Persia, where the king of Persia requested his aid in curing the plague. Hippocrates, according to legend, declined. But he was not just a healer, like his father before him. Hippocrates was also a teacher and a scholar. He created a school of medicine on Kos, where he taught many students in the ways of medicine, usually under the shade of a grand sycamore tree. Hippocrates was a hero of Athens, with a legacy intact even in modern times. Yet there are others, others who are more myth than man and deal in monsters and in magic.